Hello and welcome to the last module of SUMPES. This module is about action planning. In the module before this, the third module, you have assessed your job seeker services and your employer services within your public employment services. Ideally, you have identified some development areas. Let's say you have come to the conclusion that it would be a good idea to maybe stream your job seekers a little bit more when you do the profiling. Uh, you have been doing this until now maybe as well, but maybe you'd want to do it in a more systematic way so that not everybody will get the same service after their profile, but people will be more kind of a targeted services for each type of job seeker. Or you decide to maybe be more proactive with employers, uh, get to their vacancies before they bring them to you, etc. So, the first thing we will ask you to do in this uh, module is to prioritize what you're actually going to do your action planning around because um, your self-assessment might have brought that you need to change a lot of things or you would like to um, update a lot of the parts of the service but you cannot do everything at the same time. So priorities are important here and there will be exercises and, and, and documents that we have uh, compiled for you around the idea of how to prioritize because everything is a pro if everything is a priority nothing is a priority um, then and then that that's basically the core of this and the second product of of the whole SUMPES training after the assessment is we will ask you to do the action plan and do an action plan is technically very easy it's basically taking a sheet of paper we are suggesting um, a template uh, for it and it's to say in order to do this improvement to my service what exact tasks do I have to do so we would like you to write down the tasks then who will be responsible for implementing or for following that task is it yourself or who is it and what would be the timing this um, training is finishing now at the 10th of November so obviously we're not asking you to uh, plan something that would be finished by then but we would like you to have an action plan by then that would then have like a midterm, short-term planning of three months, half a year, one year of action planning uh, of fulfilling the task with the responsibility and ideally you'd also find a way to put some milestones uh, while you're pursuing the, the action planning to know uh, whether you have achieved and how you have achieved the little steps in between towards your goal of, for example, uh, making the uh, employability assessment of job seekers more granular or being more proactive with employers, whatever your objectives are. Uh, we will be talking about this on the 10th of November then as well, the action planning, and um, the action planning will also be the, the foundation on which you will be able to go on cooperating on this with WAPES uh, because WAPES will be then uh, offering the possibility of doing a more individual uh, assessment, action planning, Im implementation of your action plan with your public employment services if you so wish as an uh, outcome of, of, this, of this exercise here in the pilot. Um, the, this module will be uh, again shaped as all the other modules with um, a couple of documents that we would like you to read uh, two exercises of which one will be the action planning itself and then there is also a forum where we will go a bit beyond uh, of what um, consequences it might have to do uh, a change in your service and, and what kind of um, f change that might have to the mission and vision of your public employment services. Sometimes when you change something big uh, something small it might bring out a big change so this is something we would like to discuss with you as well. Um, that's then basically the, the, the whole SUMPES, that's, that's the fourth module. Uh, all the modules will stay there so you can, you can revisit them, you can think back of uh, how things connect now maybe when we started to, do, uh, to ask you to, how the self-assessment is done and, and then maybe compare it with what you're doing now after having learned um, in the third module how to, to do a self-assessment. So um, there is a couple of things that you can that you can maybe check back and uh, of course within your tutor groups and, and with the web secretariat then ask questions uh, whenever it's needed and whatever you feel a doubt about. 
Good luck with that. We are looking forward to your action plans and uh, we see you on the 10th of November in our last online meeting. Thank you very much.